Hello, so as you guys know, one of the best times of the year is coming up, and I love to do this video every year, putting together a huge wish list. So here I have over a hundred ideas, and I've been scouring the internet for good things. Like I want to TikTok, Pinterest, all these different websites to find out all the best things that you guys should add to your list, and hopefully you'll find some things that you really want. So I'm gonna split this up into a bunch of different categories, and the first one is makeup scents. I'm obsessed. Okay, so the first is the Rode Peptide Lip Treatment and the phone case. I feel like this is such an it girl thing to have right now. Along with that, also the Rode Pocket Blushes. These just look so satisfying and I want to try them out so bad. And then one other blush that I really love is a Benetint blush. I use this one every day and it's just really satisfying. So I recommend Summer Fridays. And you could also get a Summer Fridays mini package of all the different flavors so you could try them out. The Buxom Lip Gloss. I feel like no one talks about this one, but it is one of my favorites. And my friends also love borrowing it too. The Laneige Lip Sets or like the Laneige minis because one, they're hydrating and then two, they're super satisfying to use. The Shishido Eyelash Curler. I've been wanting to try this. Right now I use the Tweezerman one, but I hear this one's good and it's been on my list for a while. Then the Telescopic Mascara. I borrowed my friends and it was really good. So I want to try that out. The Ronin and Fields Lash Serum. My sweet bee had this and it worked like magic. Next is the SAE Glowy Super Gel. And then kind of along with that, the Drunk Elephant Bronzing Drops. And then the Sol de Janeiro set. This one has like all the different lotions, perfumes, and it's been a favorite for a long time, so you know it's good. The Charlotte Tilbury Setting Spray. I use this all the time and it works amazing. The Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream. Love this as well. It's super hydrating. The Charlotte Tilbury Bronzer. And then lastly, the Charlotte Tilbury Flaws Filter. If you can tell, I love that brand. And then for highlighter, a good one is the Benefit Cookie Highlighter. And then now moving on to like less makeup products but still in this category is one of those headbands that everyone uses in their Get Ready With Me's. And then you can do a makeup bag. A cute one is the Moon Nude Makeup Bag as well as the Stony Clover Makeup Bag. And then Sephora has so many different deals. They have a bunch of different value packages that you could gift and these ones will be so cute and they also have a great value to it so i would just go for like any of them they're really great honestly like i got the mascara trio set and i'm pretty sure the value was like 50 something dollars but it was 29. the lush gift box one of those tree hut sugar scrubs and then you can ask for your favorite perfume an ice roller a jusu hair mask i hope i pronounced that right guys i don't know and then lastly hair rollers Okay, now moving on to clothes, which is also my other favorite category. So first starting off with the Acne Studio Scarf. These look so cute and cozy. They are a bit more expensive, but I love the look of them. A Brandy PJ set. I have like four of these now, and I still want more because they're so comfortable and they're so adorable. You could do a Victoria's Secret pajama set or a Roller Rabbit PJ set. And then something that I really love is the Brandy Priscilla pants. Let me go show you guys. Okay, they're these pants and I wear them like at least twice a week because they're so comfortable. But they look like this and they have this fold over at the top. And then you can ask for a hoodie, just ask for one of your favorites like Aritzia, White Fox, Essentials, Skims, like you name it. And then another good one would be a sweat set. I feel like these are such a classic and you can wear them anywhere, to the airport, in your dorm. And I feel like some good ones are from White Fox or from Aritzia. And then the Aritzia Super Puff. You can also get a workout set. I feel like just having a cute workout set motivates you to go to the gym. So good ones are from Aloe, Gymshark, Lululemon. Next, I feel like everyone needs a good mini black skirt. And the one that everyone raves about is the Danielle Guzu mini black skirt. This one is a bit more expensive. But I've never heard anything bad about it, and I always see these reviews on TikTok that make me want to buy it. And then you can ask for a skim shirt, skims tank, skims dress, all super good. And then something that no one talks about is the Garage Sleek Scoop Cami Top. They're such classic, they're great quality, and they're also super affordable. Oh, and then another one is the Garage Basic Tee. I don't really know what they're called, but I have it, and it's one of my favorite shirts. And then you can ask for the Lululemon Aligned Leggings. The Lululemon Nulu jacket. And then for jeans, my favorite are the Addicted Raylan jeans. I have four of these because they're so good and my friends have tried them on. They love it too. You can also ask for going out tops from Addicted because they have really good ones and pretty much every girl in college has one from them. A black leather jacket. I feel like this is such a staple for going out or just to go out to dinners. It's super warm and it also looks really good. 
And then the last thing that I have from this category is a sports team jersey. Next are shoes. There's so many good ones that I want this year. And at the top of my list, I would say are the Adidas sneakers. There's so many good ones. I really love the platform ones. I just like platform in all different shoes because I feel like it makes your life look better. I don't know. If that's just me, comment down below if you also like platform shoes. You can get platform Converse. I have these right now and they match with pretty much every outfit. Can't really go wrong with that. The Uggs Taz, the Uggs Diskette, and then the Ugg Knit Cozy Slipper. Another sneaker that you could do is the Puma Palermo sneaker. These ones look so cool. And then something that I've seen a lot is the Sufilia Smiley Face Slippers. Hopefully I pronounced that right, but they have these little smiley faces on them and they're adorable. And then the last one are just platform knee-high boots, knee-high black boots. They go together with so many outfits and it's my favorite shoe to wear going out. And then for socks, you could do the Aritzia Sunday Scrunch. I've been wanting these for the longest time. And then lastly, fuzzy socks. Okay, and now moving on to bags. So first I have the Lawn Shop tote bag. I have the one with the navy along with every single other person in this universe. But they're so classic and they go well with every outfit and it's not like crazy expensive compared to a bunch of the other bags out there I use mine every day for school and pretty much everyone in Paris has one Another really popular bag is the Goyer tote bag. This one is really expensive, but it does look good The coach Mira shoulder bag a good mini black bag that has a zipper over it that you can bring while you're going out or just out and about Okay, that was it for bags and then now for the accessories you could do a good baseball cap either just a classic one or one of a sports team. I feel like these just always look so cool and you can wear them anywhere. You can do jewelry. There are a bunch of different brands that you can get it from like David Yearman, E. Newton, Tiffany & Co, Every Jewels, you name it. A Van Cleef necklace, claw clips. I feel like these have kind of come back more so in the past couple of months. Sunglasses, you can either just do like those square sunglasses or ask for a designer pair of sunglasses that you think that you would use a lot and then earmuffs i feel like those fuzzy little white earmuffs that you see on pinterest are adorable and i really want one of those now for the electronics so first the iphone 16 and then along with that you can get a phone case there are a bunch of cute ones out there i'll put up some pictures you can ask for a camera if you want to film or if you just want to take pictures right now i have the canon g7x mark ii and i bring this everywhere for pictures it takes like the best ones ever you can ask for a new macbook or an ipad especially one with an apple pencil because i feel like everyone just takes their notes on ipads these days along with that an ipad case and then you can also ask for airpods an airpods case beat a speaker okay something that I really want is a laptop tray for your bed because a lot of the times I don't feel like getting up out of my bed and I just want something that I can actually type on where I don't have to probe up my knees and honestly this is great for everyone like whether you're a student or you're working full-time very necessary you can also ask for an Octobuddy phone case these are the ones that you can stick to the walls anywhere and then phone wallets very important ever since I've gotten a phone wallet, I've never gone back but you do have to get one of those really high quality ones or else they're going to rip off and your cards are going to fall out. A tripod if you want to make videos. A portable charger. You should find one that has a lot of battery life in it because you're going to need it. Your friends are going to need it. It's very useful. And then lastly, a desktop vacuum. I've seen these like little ones or I've seen one of those like slime putty things that you can like just stick to your laptop. Although I'm kind of scared to use one of those. In the next category, I just have some random items. So the first is the five minute journal. I've seen this recommended everywhere, like on TikTok, YouTube, basically everyone's been talking about it, but it is a great tool and super reflective. So if you wanna be more introspective or just journal down your thoughts, then I would definitely recommend this. You can ask for card games or just for board games because these are such a good activity for you and your friends on a night in. A popular water bottle other than the Stanley is an Awala free sip. You can also ask for slime. I haven't played with slime in like a year and now I really want some, so I'm probably gonna order some for myself. This Christmas a Lego set such a good activity for you to do along with like your friends or anyone else a nail polish set a suitcase travel set with a bunch of different matching suitcases like how adorable is that and then lastly a bike we used to have three bikes in our house but somehow every single one of them has gotten a flat tire and we've never gotten a replace so I just haven't been able to bike for like the past two summers and that's something that I really want to do now I have the section of decor which is basically just stuff for your room so first is a vanity mirror not only is it good just for doing your makeup but also great for mirror selfies oh along with that I just love this but you can ask for a full length mirror a jewelry plate there's so many of these that are being sold right now there's such cute ones on Etsy they just look so satisfying you can ask for cute glassware a projector movie nights a jelly cat 
I feel like this is on everyone's list, but they're adorable. A big fluffy blanket. You can never go wrong with these. A silk pillowcase. I have one and it's such a game changer. The most satisfying thing ever and also makes your hair quality a lot better. And then along with that, a silk eye mask, especially if you have a roommate and you don't really want to be disturbed or anything, then these are great. Gel pens. I'm looking obsessed with stationery, so anything that's like super... I'll put my favorite gel pen right here, but I also love those super thin pens as well. You can ask for pastel highlighters. There are a bunch of these sold everywhere, especially on Amazon. But my favorite ones are the mild liners right now. I have these highlighters in every single shade that exists out there. Oh my gosh, something that I've seen recently that I really want is the Amazon coloring book. I'm like, I just need one. They seem so satisfying. An aloe yoga mat, a sunrise alarm clock, and then lastly, an air fryer if you want to cook. My last section is just food because I love food. <laughs> So first is True Room. We used to have these on my college campus and I was addicted to them. A crumble cookies gift card or just crumble cookies in general. A candy box. They sell so many of these online. They're actually crazy expensive, but they have the cutest candies. But if you don't want to buy one, you should make one yourself. A Starbucks gift card or Dunkin' one, whatever. Uber Eats or DoorDash gift card. Especially if you're in college, then you need this pretty much. A Barnes and Noble gift card, concert tickets, and then lastly, tickets to a sports game. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it useful. And comment down below something that you wanna put on your Christmas wish list. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.